Hi, I'm Brian with Ferronics Technical Support, and in this video, we will be going over options on how to recover from lost Deep Freeze Enterprise Workstation password. The first option would be to check if the workstation shows up in the Deep Freeze Enterprise console. If the workstation shows up in the Deep Freeze Enterprise console, we can then change the configuration to add a new password. To do this, go to the Deep Freeze Enterprise console. In the console, expand localhost on the left-hand side and click on the entire network node. If the workstation shows up, you can assign a configuration that has a password. To do this, go to Available Configurations, expand Deep Freeze, and you may create a configuration or edit the current configuration by right-clicking on it. In this case, the workstation already has the test configuration assigned to it. We are going to edit the test configuration to see the password that was assigned to the workstation. Here's the password. If this password is not there, you can check the Enable box and key in a password. Check the configuration name and then click on OK. To assign this configuration to the workstation, simply select the workstations and then drag them to the configuration. The new password should now work on the local interface. If you go to a deep freeze workstation, you have the ability to freeze or thaw the machine locally from the local interface. To open up the local interface, you may go to the system tray and hold your shift key down and double click on the polar bear icon, or use the hotkey control plus alt plus shift plus F6. Once the local interface pops up, you will be prompted to enter a password. If you enter this password incorrectly three times, the interface goes away. If the workstation is not showing up in the Deep Freeze Enterprise console, you can try using a one-time password. To use the one-time password, go to the console, go to Tools, and go to One-Time Passwords. Here you will be asked to enter a token. To get this token, go back to the workstation, open up the local interface, and you will see a one-time password token. Make a note of the OTP token and take it over to the console. In the console, enter in the token that you got from the workstation and hit Generate. Write down the one-time password and go back over to the workstation. Enter the one-time password that you just generated and hit OK. If the password does not match, this means that the customization code on the console does not match the customization code on the workstation, and that the workstation install file was created from another console, or the console customization code has been changed. The customization code is a unique identifier set up by the user who first installed Deep Freeze Enterprise. This code cannot be recovered by Pharonix or any other third party in the case it is lost. If the password does work, you should be able to get into the workstation interface to thaw the machine. Or you could also reboot Frozen if thawed already. If you have any questions or run into any issues, please contact Pharonix Technical Support. Thank you.